I didn't do well in the audition, and I realised failing at work is not just failing. I got an A, just failing to impress my supervisor. It's about whether I can stay here long enough to execute my plan. But anyway, happy thanks, starving. And adequate sleep. I always forget we get some health back for sleeping. Straight to work. Good evening. This year's audition was not a complete disaster. I know some of you have proved it to the late land one nights. The result should come in, out in a week or so. Okay, now that Thanks Starving's officially started it, no music is allowed throughout the week. And as you may guess, we shall read out the grace together before work. Now in one and two, we thank thee the great for this our food, but more because of the heightened war. Let the manner to our souls be given, the bread of life, the milk of beasts, send down from heaven. Amen. Red fish, blue fish, wow, no cover. 322. Is this a red fish? I think this is a red fish. Yeah. Oh wait, sterilizing. This is a blue fish. 328. Blue fish, red, 206, jazz. That's a blue fish. And 10, that's fine. Ooh. Blue fish, let's go. 309, that's fine. Red, that's good. 315, that's okay. Red, that's good. 319, yeah. Red, that's good. 216, yeah. It's the blue. Oops. Blue is good. 230, yeah. Blue, check. 323. Red, good. 309, that's fine. Oh, well, that one is 328. Check. 11. Oh, I don't know which one was which now. 3 to 4, that's fine. Red is good. Check. 3 16 is fine. Red is good. Red is good. 3 20 is fine. Look at you, it's very six, it's fine. Red is good. Blue is good. Blue to four is fine. Red, yep. Go. Two, three, four, just blue. It's blue. It's one. It's blue. Yep, go. Three, three, one, that's okay. Blue, that should be red. Two, three, four, that's it. Should be blue. Yeah. Red. Yeah. Red. Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh. Okay, we kind of lost it a bit towards the end there. Oh, shit, um... Oh. I didn't realise I had to do that. I, I, I knew I had to do that, but I forgot about it. So we've got two black bottles now. One mistake isn't so bad. Tired and hungry. So we should just have one. No, I shouldn't eat from the fridge, I should eat from the shelf. Go to bed. Yes! We're flying through this game now. Thanks, Starving always calms me down since I was little. 
God, that memory feels ancient. I still remember when we piled all up all weeks of rami bread and quadrupled milk on the old wooden table back home. Stocking up food was such a satisfactory other. Although it didn't change a thing at all. The good old days. A passable sleep. Got a couple of these black bottles now. Maybe I should just put it on the shelf. Ah, no, let's just break. Good evening. Okay. Sterilization is not as well. You know what to do, just read out Grace and prepare to work. We thank thee the great for this, our food, yada 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 Go. Day gradually, my week gradually declining. Still. Unknown. Quick, let me in. Sorry, let me in, please. Wait a second. Do I know you? It's not safe out here. Let me in and I'll talk. I'm not joking. Please, uh, I mean, who are you exactly? My name's Katya. I can tell you whatever you want to know later. I feel myself being watched standing out here. Um, I'm pretty sure we're in the middle of nowhere in the sky. You're, let you're letting me in or not, sir? Are you going to leave me out here l like this? I, I just... Wait, how did you even get here? Whatever brought me here is gone, please. Don't leave me here to the dust and wind and ice. All right, but you've got to deal. Tell me what's going on here. I will. I promise. Okay then. It's a bit messy inside, though. Thank you, sir, from my heart. You can call me Ned. So, um, Katya, 
Are you ready to explain this? Yes, sir. I'm an outsider. You might know that already from my name. I paid for someone to take me here. Eden. They promised to me to take me somewhere safe in Eden. They gave me give me a new ID. I was on the way here, the driver. He suddenly asked me to get off at your balcony. He told me to try staying inside the booth and wait for someone to pick me up after a week or so. What could I do? I had no choice. And do you know what happened next? That is bold. Those people told me it's going to be safe. Said something about some festival. God, if I only knew I'd been left here alone. I'm sorry for what happened, but I guess they're aiming for thanks starving because we have least, the least traffic now. But it didn't get me to the destination. Well, there must be a reason. So, uh, you're entering Eden illegally? Please, sir, don't report on me. I only want a safe place to live. Ah, I don't want to do anything bad to your city, I swear. Katia, if this is found out, I can offer you something in return, something valuable, if you just let me stay here for a few days. Please, listen, Katia. If I helped you and someone found out, we're both going to jail, at the very least. The rest of our life will be ruined. So what do you suggest? I already trespassed the border. There's no turning back for me now, is there? And I'd rather die than going back. My life's no different than ruined. Aw, oh, man. God's help, poor Cassia. Okay, then. You can stay. Oh, God. You are a saver, sir. I'm nobody. Let's just pray for a good end for both of us. And uh, another thing is, I won't have enough food for two people. Don't bother. I can survive a week without food. <laughs> just give me some water. What? Are you sure? Yes, I've done it before, sir. Okay, then. You can sleep on my bed for the next couple of days. I'll take the floor. No need. I'm fine with the floor. And please, if you're not going to eat, take the bed at least. We can share it if you don't mind. It's not that small. Sure, why not? Thanks. I'm the one who should say thank you. Take this uh, as a gift. Catch you as Matt. It's a map. We've not seen one before. <laughs> but I've not seen it with my own eyes. Wow. This looks and feels amazing. Amazing? Just wait till you get into bed with her if you like her map. You're not allowed to make... To own or make these in Eden. Not that many people know what it is now even. I can't believe. Sorry, if it's forbidden, you can just burn it or throw it away. Hmm, excuse me, sir. I'm just exhausted by the ride. Let me just lie down for a while. May I? Sure. Okay. Yes, she is lying on the bed. Better let her rest now. Catch it, I'm going to sleep now. Catch you. Looks like she's already asleep. What a day for both of us. The plot thickens. The last thing I expected in Thanksgiving is a visitor. Thanks starving is a visitor. Let alone sharing a bed with her. I've never done such a thing before. She smells exotic. As absurd as it might be, I also decided to help her out. Hope it doesn't turn out to be a big mistake. Dear Inspector, thank you for interest in why tie in no insurance. Attaches an application form, fill it in and send it back. Unexpected to visit her and thanks starving, trying to steal into Ireland. I decided to help her in her stay in my Okay. Where's the form? Good morning! Oh, you're awake. Good morning! Will I disturb your work? I'll only be sitting here. Uh, no, not at all. Alright, if you want, there's some books you can read up above the shelf. Thank you, sir. I forgot there were books. Uh, work, I guess. We can't order food. 
good evening. I believe you've all got your stamp set. Here we go. New complexity. Today we'll do something different. Putting stamps on pigs. <laughs> Careful though, it's not as easy as it sounds. There's some pigs with little black dots on their bodies. Find them out and use the green stamp on them. Black dots are equals green. And for those without any black dots, go with the red stamp. You make a new mistake, just put a new stamp on, you'll always check the last one. That's all. I read the grace and prayer for work. We thank the great deal, yeah, 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 yeah. So, black dots equal green. <laughs> okay. No black dots. Black dots. Black dots. Black dots. No black dots. Black dots. Black dots. Black dots, black dots. Okay. No dots. 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 Two in a row, what were the odds? Oh, sneaky tail dots. Lots of black, no lots of black. Okay, this is an experiment. Done. Hey, we did one without making a mistake again. Get so much more money from doing that. Tired and hungry. Sir, pardon me for asking. I saw you stamp all those pigs. I feel the people who took me here did say one thing true. Aiden is indeed a wealthy city. Do people here all have food like that? Not really. Those pigs aren't for civilians. Few people eat them from board port. Not the good parts, at least. Oh, sorry, don't be. You can probably see more, some more common food in the coming days. What do you usually eat in your city? Potatoes. For worst days, tree bark. Oh god, Eden is better in that sense. I guess that's why you want to leave that place. Not entirely. I like potatoes. Not so keen on tree bark. But when one's starving, nothing else seems to matter. That's true. Uh, by the way, Katya. Do you mind telling me which city you're from? I suppose it's on the map you gave me, right? The one on the top, the northeast. Let me see. Uh, Wormansk. Yes. 
their famine in Wormansk now. Been going on for years. Since when? Since crops started to fail and no one knew what to do a long time ago. And the winter is getting more intolerable. You mean cold? Have you walked on an ice lake before? An ice lake? Never seen one in my life. That used to be the playground of children in Wormansk. Used to be? Yes, because now the coldness outside can freeze them to death in winter. How can people live in such weather? It's warmer near the harbour, but it's not enough to hold everyone. Some have to be given up. Wow, it seems pretty bad in Wormansk. Given up? Who gets to decide that? The Lord's controlling the harbour, of course. And you? I decided to leave. I can't stand living under their mercy. You can't, can't imagine how they treat people like me. People like you? Girls, women, we're those. They do worse things to us than the winter. What about your families? Did they leave Wormansk as well? Uh, sorry, I'm asking too much. It's okay if you don't want to talk about it. I don't, sorry. I should probably go to sleep now. Dreams may ease my hunger. Can we not give her some food? We've definitely got enough food for her too. read a book. Just to see what happens. Oh wow, we get health. I didn't realise you got health for reading books. I'm going to bed now. Okay, have a good sleep. How do you do, sir? It seems more than target area can be an option, although the rules can be a headache to deal with, although Catcher is obviously getting weaker. Maybe I should ration my food with her. Yeah, maybe. No shit. Power voice is unrestricted. If it's too cold, it's too little food. How do I give her some food? Oh. God damn it. I just feel sleeping. The room is quiet enough to hear her breathing. That just doesn't seem to let me give it to her. Okay, we stamping tricks again. Good evening. You know that smell seafood came in at rainy nights again. Read out the grace and prayer to her. Yada 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 Okay, fish, and there's prawns now, I'm sterilising, 320, that's big enough, I guess we don't need to stamp anything, blue to a bio, blue, 333, that's okay, should be red, yes, go, prawn, blue 105, 105, blue, Okay. Look. Wait, did that say 309? I don't think that one was right. So this is red. Yeah, right. okay. 239. No, that's too heavy. 105. This is it. Blue. Yep. Yeah. 336. That's too heavy. 322. That's okay. Okay, that's kind of silly. 328, that's a red, that's a red. Red, that's a red. Okay, that's a red. 322, that's a red. Blue, that's a red. Red, that's a red. 128, that's a red. 309, blue, that's a red. Great, that's okay. Zero seven. That's okay. Pause that. One two two. That's okay. Blue. No, that's a big one. That should be red. Three two four. That's okay. That was blue. That's okay. It should be two two light. 
couldn't see that. Three, two, three. Okay, red, that's okay. Go. Red, that's okay. One, two, three is okay. One, one, three. Blue is good. One, two, six. It's okay. Blue is good. Blue is good. Shit. Two, two, nine is okay. Blue is three, one, nine is okay. Oh my god. Three, two, seven. Why is that closed? Go. Red. Red. Back. Three, three, three. Red is good. One, three, five. Blue is red. Go. I can't believe I made a mistake right to the end there. Holy shit, this is getting more complicated. Hard and hurry. Sorry I slept in this morning. Uh, this evening, I mean. Oh, it's fine. I was a bit afraid of waking you up. Did I? No. Smile. I had a good sleep. Great, how are you feeling today? You don't look too well, sir. I'm fine. Are you sure? It's like it's a horror, sir. Did you just say something like a prayer for you? It's just to express our gratitude. <laughs> for the food we're blessed with in Eden. So do you also believe in higher power? a higher power? Who blessed you with the food? To be honest, I don't know. I don't really know who actually made our food. What do you mean, make your food? Oh god, my heart. It's okay, Gertrude. Stay quiet, I'll get it. Hello. Oh, hi, Elodie. It's me. How have you been doing, my friends? God, listen. I think I made it clear enough last time. Hmm? This life does change the younger you, doesn't it? I don't want to make it sound like a threat, but how about this thing? We now have some crucial information concerning your safety. What? Information from our ears in the Bureau. Do you expect me to just believe you like that? I don't expect anything from you right away, of course. After all, you're having such a good time now as a new inspector. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Don't talk about it like you know everything. Some black bottles are coming. Take at least one for us and we'll be happy to share all what we know. I'll send someone to collect them after thanks starving. And before that, make your choice. Who's that? Don't worry, just some promotion. Promotion? Uh, yeah. Sorry, I don't mean to offence your house, sir, but this place just gives me creeps. Um, anything wrong with the house? It's just too quiet. Well, since you're in the middle of the sky, yes, that too. Don't you find it strange to be living here? Not really. Why? You can't just leave this place, can you? No, I don't think I can. You can't just survive on your own here, can you? Not without food. So prison it is. Prison? Maybe worse. What if they just leave you here, sir? Uh, I'll be dead, I think. Exactly, sir. We're like lambs in the fence, and the butchers, they feed us, and might just be watching us right now. I've never thought about it this way. Sir, I hope we can both leave this place soon for a better one. Thanks, Katya. Pardon me for this strange talk. Time for us to rest. Uh, yes. She's just looking on the bed. Oh, um... Keep the bird in there. Here, take it. I can't just let you starve like this. I'm fine, you really don't have to. You catch it, I have much, much more than this. Don't give me a worry about me at I... Thank you, sir. You're a good man. I won't forget it. Okay.
go to bed. Yes, indeed. Guess I'll see you tomorrow then. Okay, despite the house, have a good sleep, sir. So we must be nearing the end of the week now. She was right. This booth in the sky is a prison and Eden is no better than that. Working with that man doesn't seem too bad an idea now, just maybe. Also, I shared some food with Katya yesterday. I don't know what would happen to her once she arrives in the city if she ever makes it. This is the least I could do. I'd known I could feed her then. I rushed my food with Katya. Okay. A possible sleep. Good evening, sir. Hey, you're up. Yes, I'll just be sitting here while you work. Every time I go the wrong way. <coughs> okay. Focus, focus. Good evening. I know your food supply may be running low since it's five days and tiny starving, so I'll probably warn you about the temptation coming on its way. We're handling some top class meat products today. I know what you're thinking. Work hard and you'll get to eat them someday. Now read out the race and prepare to work. Now, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we are sterilizing. Yellow and red. Steak. Four, three, nine. Yellow. Two, eight. Wage deducted for being a little bit slow. That's disappointing. And I was only a tiny bit slow. And these days I keep, they keep sending luxury, luscious food to town. I'm sorry if it gives you the wrong impression. Isn't it because of the festival? I don't know. Thanks, Darwin. It's just a memorial of the great famine. 
what do people usually eat in the evening? Mostly candle condensed food. It doesn't sound bad to me. Well, and so you don't seem to be eating those. Uh, yes, that's just... Oh, here it comes again. You should guess it, sir. I'll be quiet. Went the right way. Hey, it's me. Oh, hey. I've been waiting for your call. Don't you have better things to do up there? Not really. How did it go? I gave him the card and I went inside with him. Oh, thanks. How's she doing? She's doing okay, according to one caretaker there. We didn't catch her awake, though. Yeah, she's, uh, she likes to sleep a lot lately. What did she have? They said it's food poisoning. Oh, don't worry. She'll be fine. Ned, people there also talking something else. What's wrong? They said there'll be a restriction on visitors soon. Restriction? What kind? Visitors will have to apply for entrance after this week or so. What? That's like in two days? Yes, such short notice if they ever plan for one. Can the application be turned down or anything? Not clear about that. I can go ask them if you want. Don't bother. One guy I know will go there soon. Guess he'll find out. Thank you, really, Elodie. You've been a great help. Anytime, Ned. Enjoy the rest of the festival. See you soon. What's wrong? Uh, nothing. You don't look like it. Sir, if you want someone to talk to you, I'm all ears. I'm not going to tell anyone. You know I wouldn't dare. I know, besides, it's not something you have to hide. Let's hear it then. Well, remember when I asked you about your families the other day? Back then I was just thinking about mine. I don't have that much to do up here, you know, so I think about them a lot. Not that I have many families to think about. In fact, there's only me and my mother. But my mum, she's, uh, sorry, it must be boring for you to hear me talking about this. No, sir, it's much less boring than sitting here all day in silence. Um, true that. Anyway, my mum, she's been in a coma for years. Oh, that must be tough on you. Yes, especially as I know that she may never wake up again. The doctor said the chance is like winning the top prize of Eden's lottery. I'm sorry, that phone call just now was saying they're going to have a new restriction on visitors of the care centre. It just reminded me of a question I've been thinking over and over in the past few years. What is it? What's the right way for me to live? What do you mean? I mean, oh, forget it. It's stupid. Sir, I may not know much about your situation, or family indeed, and family can get quite complicated sometimes, but I do believe in one thing. It often helps clear my doubts. What's that? The least wrong does not count as the right. Well, what do I know? No, it's... I'm not sure if I get what you mean, but thanks. It just feels so good to finally talk about it. Talk to someone about it. Smile, it's getting late. Yeah, maybe we should rest, sir. I wonder if the man is ever going to pick me up. It's almost five days. Don't worry too much, Katya. There's still some time before thanks starving ends. Let's just wait until then. Okay. three of those bottles now. Have some fries. Sure, thank you for your generosity. Doesn't seem to do anything else. Go to bed, yes. I'm heading to bed. See you tomorrow then, Katya. Good dreams, sir. Just the one, though. Okay, we're going to do um, one more round and one more day and then we're going to stop for the session it's strange how people can share some of the deepest feelings with someone they just met Katya should be leaving either today or tomorrow I'm just as nervous as she does strangely somehow I talked with Katya about my mother which I haven't done with someone else is this like some kind of crazy dating game? A passable sleep. Seems like Katya is still sleeping. She must have been too worried for her. I felt her test and turned quite a lot yesterday. Went the right way for work. Let's do it. Good evening. 
a patch of eggs and condensed vegetables are passing through together. These eggs are finished goods, so no need for tests. You just need to put a red stamp on each pack of them. And secondly, you can touch the two old tests on vegetables. Now read out the grace and clear. So red stamp on eggs. Green 155 to 185. That's too heavy. Red stamp on eggs. Did I dump that last thing? I didn't mean to. A stupid thing to say. Okay. Oh, I meant to just use it. So I don't seem to need to give her stuff every day, but let's talk to her anyway. Petra is quietly sitting in bed. Not that much emotion on her face. Never mind. Okay, we're going to do one more day because that one was way too easy. I feel like we've got to end on a hard one. Oh, oh God! It must be the man to pick me up, right? Wait, we don't know that yet. Go hide under the bed catcher now. Okay. Good morning. Oh, it's you. I hope you've enjoyed Frank starving. Normally, I wouldn't come in this early, but they asked me to deliver you this new equipment. This one needs a little bit of installation. May I go inside for a minute? Uh, sorry, I need to go inside and install this. Is there a problem? Um, no, not at all. You can come in in, in a minute. It's a bit messy inside. I should tidy things up. No, no, don't have time for that. It's not like I'm judging anyway, right? Okay, then. Let me just get the door for you. Huh. Look at you, already making this place like coming. Well, I just bought something to kill time with. Smart. Things just do get bored. Things do get bored fast up here if you don't shop. Okay now, give me a minute here and I'll finish the installation. Oh, 
all set. Your supervisor will tell you how to use it later. Thanks. Hmm, do you smell something? Smell? No, I don't think so. Oh, maybe I'm just used to it already. Kind of smells kind of special, not like in the other booths. Oh, is it from my shelf? Just remember there's still some left over from last week. My god, you need to throw it in the recycle holes right away. For your own sake. Yeah, definitely. We'll do in a minute. You don't want to see, to see me do it. Trust me. By the way, I still can't take any shopping orders today. Got some more booths to go. See you soon then, Mr. Crawford. Katya, she's gone. Katya? I don't know. I should be happy or sad right now. Relieved at least? Why would you help me like this, sir? I mean, you could have rejected me or reported me just now, easily. You just work for the government, don't you? Yeah, but that doesn't mean I have to listen to whatever they say. Why? A lot of people listen to survive. I know. Sorry, sir. I don't mean to ask you such difficult questions. I just wanted to say thank you. Not at all. We're both in this right now, you know. I just hope everything else can work out tomorrow. Me too. Right, we are going to end here, guys. It's the perfect time, story-wise, to end, so... Time to rest, Katya. If that means sharp. If that man shows up tomorrow, it'll be a long day for you. So get some sleep now while you can. You're right, sir. Good dream. You too. Okay, thanks for watching, guys. We'll be back with another part of this very soon. Have a good day.